continue to pick up the pieces after last week's storage facility fire in Lebanon, including the Lynn County program of Special Olympics Oregon. Thanks for joining us here at 4. I'm Albert James. In a follow up this afternoon, KEZI 9 News reporter Julio Moore Rodriguez spoke with them about their losses and how they're doing right now. The last couple of days have been a source of frustration and anxiety for people with the Lynn County program of Special Olympics Oregon. That being said, as the smoke clears, they tell me that they're in a better position than others who lost valuables in last week's fire. We um, have some money in our in our coffers to be able to help uh, with this, uh, but we're still trying to figure out where where we're at and what we need. Local program coordinator Janine Toplin says they've built up an emergency fund thanks to their fundraising efforts. Also to their benefit, their storage unit was insured. While they still don't know how much damage was done, a lot of the equipment for sports this season was not in the storage unit itself. But most of our uh, coaches had carried their stuff, so we still have uh, our bocce equipment, we still have our track equipment, uh, we still had our unified softball equipment. The program is preparing for events coming up in the fall, and there are ongoing summer events right now like track and bocce. Many of the uniforms for these sports were lost in the fire, but the program has gotten help. And thankfully the Portland office has helped us walk through that and get uh, our shirts and, and everything that we need for that. And we've uh, had some generous donations uh, with companies that have provided us with softball equipment for today. I got to see that come in, so that was special to be able to watch that. Coming up in a special edition of KZI 9 News at 8, I'll show you how the Lynn County Special Olympics team is bouncing back from this storage facility fire. Reporting in Lebanon, Julio Mora Rodriguez, KZI 9 News. And a traffic alert this afternoon.